sue them, so they were obligated to give me $5,000 a month. But then I won. You've heard it and you've seen it, but you have not seen such a video as this. Thank you for tuning into my channel today. I'd like you to watch this video and I'd like you to tell me what you think about it. I'm going to leave the comments open for the next few days. Please leave your comments. But uh, most importantly, subscribe to this channel, like this channel. And hit the notification bell of this channel so that you know when new videos come out. But this is important. A young lady full of vitality and strength sues her parents to pay her $5,000 every month. Only in America. Watch this. Originally, I did just ask my parents for money every month. Um, but eventually they told me, look, Cass, you're going to have to find a way to get this money on your own. We can't just like hand everything to you for the rest of your life. And I said, okay. Um, that's when I decided to write up this lawsuit and sue them. So they were obligated to give me $5,000 a month. And it was kind of like me just being petty. Um, but then I won and like, they thought it was funny. They laughed about it. They were like, well, I mean, you found a way to get your money. Um, you had to earn it, I guess. But anyway, it, it was kind of like a joke, but they're not mad at me. We're still on good terms. Um, so I, yeah, it, it's, people don't know the full story and they're so quick to make judgments and hate on me. But, um, but no, like it, it was a funny joke, but I got $5,000 a month out of it. So, so she sues her parents and she was making it a kind of like a joke being petty, she says, and the court system actually granted her and awarded her what she sued for. So let me let you guys know something that you need to understand. She just said a preset a precedence that other jurisdictions can refer to in such court cases. So let that go over your mind. And now I notice why all the young Gen Z or I don't know what is, is it Gen Z now? The millennials, whatever they are, especially the young people that were still are still growing up they're not in their they're on they're under 25 this is the reason why most of them don't want to have children one laziness fear and retaliation because this is what they're they're, they're doing this to their parents and hoping that they don't get the repercussion so in order for them to avoid or evade the repercussion they choose not to have children they stop working or they don't work at all. They just post stuff on social media, social media lifestyle. And in addition to that, they just pretty much look for ways to get funds by attacking their own parents or suing their parents in this case. Well, this is what this is the world we live in. Watch the next one when she wants goes to Walmart. And for sure, she has children. But how did she get those children? She adopted them. Watch this. I mentioned in my last video that I went clothes shopping for my children. And a lot of people are shocked to hear that I have children, considering I sued my parents for having me without my permission. But I just want to make a couple of things clear here. So my parents that I sued, they contributed to, you know, conceiving me. And my mother that raised me, she gave birth to me. Um... And that's why I sued them because I did not consent to being here. Like I was unaware that I was going to have to grow up and get a job um, to support myself. And I, there, I just didn't consent to that. They didn't try to contact me in any way before I was born to see if I actually wanted to be here. Um, and that's why I sued them. Now, it's different. Like I know I've said it's like unethical to have children before, but it's different when you adopt because... It's not my fault that they're here. I'm just trying to be a good person and like help them out. You know what I mean? Um, so yeah, if you are pregnant right now, you need to go, you need to hire a psychic medium and ask your child if they actually want to be here. Um, but keep in mind, if they don't, you, you need to terminate. Otherwise they will sue you because I'm making that my life mission to teach children to sue their parents so they don't have to work. Um, but yes, that I do have children, but I adopted them. So I had them in like an ethical way. Now she's saying that 
you have to go to meet a psychic medium okay to find out if your child wants to be born this is while you're pregnant and she's her, her focus is mainly on women not even talking about the men mainly on women if the child wants to be born and if the child doesn't want to be born after communicating through medium the psychic medium then you have a choice now or you have the legal right i'm not putting words in her mouth you have the right to terminate the child you should choose to terminate remove the child okay this is the world we're living in now a childless it's, we're going to have a childless nation or childless world just on top of that that if you choose to then have this child this child would then grow up and then sue you because they don't want they were they were they did not sign a consent to be born they did not sign a consent to come into this world and work they did not sign a consent to be alive but you chose to put them here so you're responsible for bringing them into this world and you're responsible for their daily living they have hands they have feet they have legs they have a head they have a brain they're not disabled oh this world this world this world we live in this world we live in listen to the best tip i have for you is to just become a liberal and vote democrat because when you prove that you vote democrat um they will give you everything for free uh that's why my generation doesn't work because we get everything handed to us and there you have it just hit the nail on the head this generation do not like to work they do not want to work they do not they choose not to work because they want a government that will give everything to them free they want hands me hand me downs or how uh, how they put it lazy pay that's what i call it lazy pay you don't work but you get paid you don't do anything but you get paid you just post stuff on social media and then you get paid you just live in your parents house and you get paid you live in a city owned property and you get paid the whole world is getting lazy the whole world is getting lazy and this are the people that are pre preaching such message so that other people will hear there's a platform for them to do that i'm not stopping them from saying what they're saying but if utu not apulegirisi then you should just sit yourself in your house and not bother the world with your laziness and let those people who really mean to have a future for humanity continue to raise humanity and those who choose not to if you're asking your parents that they should have terminated you because you had no consent then what choice now do you have for yourself that you are alive to progress humanity thank you for watching my channel this is just sad subscribe like notification bell and your comments and we'll see you on the next one have a good day